guys welcome to visual trimmer this is our first video where we are going to see how to remove green screen using fusion 8 so this is fusion 8 and today i'm going to tell you that according to me which is the easiest way of removing green screen there are three there are many green screen removing tools like chroma key trimet luma key but we are going to see which is the best according to me what i feel is chroma key has an edge over the other keyers so we'll start this is our sequence we'll uh, drag down this sequence to the fusion file over here and uh, and after we drag it down we have to drag it upside so that it will appear on the source panel the next step is we have to press Ctrl plus space bar and type chroma key here. And then we have to connect the output of this sequence to the input of chroma key here. Then we just have to, you will see nothing is working because we haven't dragged it upside and now you can see the magic. We, it will be difficult to remove chroma in this conditions because I'll, I'll take this out again I'll delete it first we'll, I'll show you why it is difficult to remove the main problem is this wrinkles this wrinkles and this unwanted area because while removing chroma the color which is which the chroma key is reading has to be similar and this wrinkles will create obstacle to remove this chroma so what we'll do is we'll, we'll work on this much area so that uh, our uh, work gets easy so for that we have to take a rectangle you can either take it from here or else press ctrl plus space bar rectangle here it is and we just have to take the area at which we are working on it is not taking a lot of space so we'll just take this much of work area all right so you will notice that this wrinkles are not coming inside this box so we just will just keep this box over here okay and then we'll take chroma key here then we'll connect the output of sequence to the input of chroma key here and we'll connect the output of this box into this white garbage mat not here on this white one all right then you drag it upside and then you will see that our character has been deleted you don't need to worry just double click on rectangle press invert and here it is and now you can work on it click on chroma key or drag it upside and then you can just work like this In this video we are just going to see how to remove the green screen and not the compositing part. I will show you the compositing part in the next tutorial. So till that stay tuned. Okay we are almost done. Okay. Okay we are almost done. Just don't go so deep that it will create problem to your character okay this much is enough then we have to just click on image green then well done then you will see the magic yes the green color is being suppressed and now click on matte increase a bit of matte blur we'll keep it 0.2.5 0.25 and I'll expand sorry I'll contract it been perfectly removed we'll just do some tweakings yeah now we are done now we will 
click on A and this alpha channel will open up and then you can see like whether the chroma is perfectly removed if you will get some dots over here then you have to work on it now it's looking completely fine for me so I think that's it so the chroma has been clearly removed and uh, you can see it's looking perfect so that's it for today if you have any doubts or queries regarding chroma removal or vfx tutorial that you want me to make then don't forget to comment down below also if you want to work on this footage then send me an email i have mentioned my email id in the description thank you